Dear friends and followers, welcome to another video of Bravo Architects. In today's video, I'm going to talk about architecture and music. So, quickly, I will mention three subtitles for this topic. And the first one will be architecture directly related with music. We can even say influenced by music. So, the second one will be literally making architecture for music or we can uh, we can also uh, call it as uh, architecture becoming music so it should be something like a literal project for music or uh, even a smaller substance and the third one which is my favorite i'm going to talk about it detailly further in the video stay tuned So speaking of mainly architecture and music, both have common principles. So there are rhythm, texture, pattern, harmony, uh, proportions, and dynamics, both in architecture and music. So uh, we can we can differentiate them in the beats and repetitions in music, as well as in the shapes and structure systems in architecture. Well, the best architectural example for this is Notre Dame de Longchamp by Le Corbusier. If you take a closer look more carefully, you can differentiate the, the various principles of design elements as it can be used in music or influenced by it. When you realize these elements being used in architecture, you really uh, understand why Goethe has said architecture is frozen music. So the second subtitle I want to talk about is architecture becoming music, literally. You can see one of the examples in my design week videos that I uploaded last year. So there was this instrument that has some vertical metallic elements that detect the amount of electrons on our fingers. So we can use them as instruments as the amount of electron is captured and uh, transmitted to a uh, speaker through a synthesizer. I'm gonna put the link in the description so you can check it out how I tried to you know, play the, the soundtrack of Interstellar on that video. You can literally integrate music within architectural or urban space. And the third topic, architecture is not directly related with music, but I'll tell you why it's my favorite. Because when you live, actually you have music integrated in your life all the time. Either you're an architect or you have another occupancy. So you listen to music, whatever you do. And as architecture is in our architect's life, we get to spend more time with projects uh, at the same time listening to some kind of music. And that actually makes the music work as a uh, flash memory, as a USB stick that you used to work on some projects and listen to certain music at the, at the very moment you were working on the project. And this can be in uh, any year in the, in the past. So when you hear that sound five years later, you would automatically uh, re remember those flashbacks, those memories that you were working on that specific projects as if you inserted that USB stick to the, to the computer to see what's inside. So it literally uh, saves data to that specific melody. It can be visual memories, it can be a smell even, feelings and emotions and etc. As for me, I have plenty of those memories in, uh, in the past years. So I'm a person that listens to pretty much every kind of music. But there are two genres that are constantly in my life that I listen to it every time. One is Deep House and the other one is Hip Hop. You can see how especially Deep House is 
reflecting all those repetitions and proportions in architecture. So I'm gonna show you a quick footage of one minute of the video uh, from a concert. I mean, it's impossible for you to uh, have the same feelings as I did when I was recording it. It's a video after all, and uh, you're not gonna get the same feelings, but at least you can understand the, the, how the melody is shaped, how does it sound like, and you can you can actually at least understand how how amazing that is. So let's go ahead and watch it. Well, I could show you a full of these art music stuff if we had enough time for this video, but I want you to enjoy the rest of it yourself on your playlist, trying uh, to record your own memories in specific music. You may be aware of them or not, so that will be something amazing for every architecture practitioner, I suppose. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel if you still haven't and smash the like button if you enjoyed this video. Stay in peace and listen to good music. See you until next time.